video and this video is about the comparison between magnetic and electrical circuits so this is not a definite comparison it is not a comparison as to how a magnetic circuit will operate and it could be compared by uh, with uh, electric circuit but this is an analogy which can be used to show uh, the similarity between the magnetic and the electrical circuits so in magnetic circuit uh, if you consider a simple example of a magnetic circuit should be can be shown by a coil uh, which is or a solenoid which is more which is supplied with the DC source of voltage V and a current I is flowing through this coil. The coil has a number of turns N and this is producing a flux phi in the uh, core. So and same way the electrical circuit can be shown like there is a resistance which is R and the voltage is V and the current flowing is I. So the MMF or the flux is given by phi and the unit is Weber is very similar to the current in the electrical circuits. So just saying this for the magnetics and this for the electrical so I is equal to the current and flux is given by the Weber unit uh, the MMF can be given as Ni it can be given by ampere turns and the flux is given by phi and the flux can be given by Ni by or uh, ampere turns or a, a, MMF divided by uh, reluctance S. So this is very similar to how the EMM is equal to the volts and the the current I is equal or the resistance. R is equal to V by I or the current I is equal to V by R and the flux density B is given by Weber per meter square or B by A which is very similar to the current density J which is given by I by A unit is ampere per meter square and the reluctance S of the magnetic circuit can be given by L upon U not U R A and the resistance is given by V by I or it is also given by R is equal to rho L by A and the, this is the reluctance and this is a resistance the inverse of reluctance is known as something like permeance and the inverse of resistance is known as something like conductance and if you see for a A series circuit then the total MMF QS1 plus QS2 plus QS3 will be equal to the total MMF that is consisting of different series magnetic circuit and the same EMF V will be equal to IR1 plus IR2 plus IR3 
So here the current will be same while here the uh, or this is a flux sorry the flux will be same here. So this is how it is possible to compare the magnetic and the electrical circuits in a very simple way. This is not a comparison but it is more of an analogy which can say that how some of the components in the magnetic uh, circuits are very much uh, similar to some of the components in the electrical circuits.